Let's have a look around. Okay. left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. I can't reach that brick. That place is full of TVs and electronics. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. I can't reach that brick. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. It's a combination lock. A few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. Let's head back inside. Okay. Hey, Carly. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go.
Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right, that wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Drew some attention. Be careful. I'm done trying to punch out windows. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. He's gone and we can't use that much.
at that wall. Safe there. one by the car without attracting the others. smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. What are you going to do with that? Tools, when making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> 